Oh, wow. Hi. Alex Hannigan. Just working on your uh, working on your daily routine here. Uh, yeah, my daily routine. Yes, lots of axe. Yeah, lots of axe throwing and chopping and yeah, lots of axe movement and uh, a little bit of skateboarding too. So. Yeah, it's important. All right, good deal. We're here with Alex Hannigan, uh, Canadian uh, crusher here, <laughs> absolutely dominated here on qualifying day. How you feeling after the uh, runs today? Uh, I feel great. Yeah, really satisfied with my performance. Um, one thing that really surprised me is that um, my second run felt a lot better. Like I felt like I was a lot closer to the edge of grip on the slide corner, which kind of gave me the feeling that I must have entered it a lot faster. And then after that, I really held my hands behind my back a lot more. Um, on the first run, I let go for a second over ski jump and yeah. And then I also, after the chicane, after the fast chicane on the first run, I readjusted a little bit. And then in the second run, I just kept it locked and, you know, I was pumping every single chance I had to, I was pumping all the whoops. So, you know, gain a little extra speed. And then it turned out that the first run was faster. So I was really surprised by that. Um, I'm just using scrubbed wheels for quality because I really want to save all my freshies for like racing, you know, so yeah. Wow, so fastest time on scrubbed wheels. Impressive. What was the split between your uh, your first and your second run? Oh, um, I don't know actually. I know that the second run was slower. I don't know by how much. I would love to find out though, yeah. Gotcha, gotcha. We can take a look at that later and, uh, and see just how much, but uh, you uh, looking forward to racing tomorrow? Oh, definitely. I'm really looking forward to racing because with this format, we're going to be getting, you know, six or seven race seats back to back. Just, you know, like that's good racing experience. And the way the format runs, um, I'm not going to explain it to you guys right now because it's kind of like I don't even fully understand it myself. But long story short, I'll probably be racing like the same six or seven people all all four heats or however many it is, like, I'll be racing the same people a lot. So, like, you know, I'll be racing Owen over and over again. So, kind of, after the first few runs, everybody's going to reveal their secrets, and then it's going to be like a chess game. It's going to be, what's the next move? Everybody's going to be using a lot of strategy tomorrow, so I'm excited for that, just to race some top-notch racers six runs in a row. That's awesome. And it's also awesome for everybody lower down in the field because it's sort of like performance balancing. Like the way the format works and the way that Riley created this algorithm and he's created software and everything, he's like a genius. Um, so he's got the same like skill level racing. So you'll be racing people, uh, you know, approximately your skill level. And then if you succeed in that heat, then you move up slightly. And you can claw your way up. Sure. And so, you know, it's nice to pay the money to travel here and get a solid amount of racing in, you yeah. know. Yeah, time. get a lot of rounds. It'll be interesting to see uh, how it works out. It's definitely a new format for the sport. So I think we're all looking forward to watching it. And you're coming off of uh, an unfortunate DQ in uh, Italy. You got a, you got a bone to pick? Or, uh, how, how, you know, how's that faring into your mentality this weekend? Yeah, well, I mean, there was a second there after that race where I was like, fuck this. Like, I just spent the last year and a half working up to this moment, and it got ripped away from me. And I'm like, why would I go to all this effort? Like, it sort of sucks the motivation out of you, but then I said, no, 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 no. I can't let that happen. So instead, I just thought, like, what's the soonest chance, like, the, the, the soonest chance I can get to go and do some more racing, I'm just going to take it. Yeah. So it was sweet. Coming off a race like Italy, going straight to this, you know, it's like, yeah, there's they're similar in some ways, and they're different in a lot of ways, too. You know, this is very grassroots, and Italy was really, like, sort of more modern racing, so it's nice, like, two, two weeks, you know, just the difference that two weeks can make from Italy to here. It's amazing. Yeah, it's a good perspective. Sure. Well, awesome. Good luck tomorrow, and I'll be excited to watch you race. Congratulations on top time. Thank you very much. All right, see you guys.